What's up you guys? Phonesmith here. Welcome to my daily vlog. Today I'm going to be working on a Pokemon armor, specifically a Venusaur armor. I'm going to be making the thigh armor for that. And I said armor a lot right there. Anyway, I'm going to be working on that today, so let's get to it. Okay, so first things first, the thigh armor is actually going to look like palm trees. I have the measurements on my phone right now. But before I start, something that I usually tell people when they're starting out, you always have this problem where the paper's always going up. Honestly, I just crumble it up. And then it usually stays flat a lot easier. Yeah. So let's check out the measurements. All right, so the thigh length is 17.5 inches. So, that's the measurements that I'm going to use to make the pattern. So to make the pattern, I'm gonna, first I'm going to fold this in half. Coming up all the way in half, that way you can actually use more of it. Later on. So, 17 and a half inches. I'm gonna go with 16. I'm just gonna go with 17. To give it a little bit of space. So, it's folded in half. Now I'm just gonna cut along this line, then unfold it, and I should have a palm leaf style thigh armor, or whatever you want to call it. Alright, so I fold it. Alright, so I have the foam. We're just going to set this on top. Now, to cut it out. So now I'm going to flip this over and trace this piece. Okay. You're going to cut on the inside of this line instead of on top or outside because if you cut on top or outside then this piece is going to end up being bigger than this piece and you want them to be the same. So if you cut on the inside it's literally the same edge as this piece, so it's going to fit a lot better on it. So now I'm going to heat gun them.
And there you have it, guys. Palm tree leaf style thigh armor. Uh, I think it looks pretty decent. Uh, I'm happy with it. That's it for today. Yeah, again, these are not tutorial videos. They're just like follow along with me <laughs> during my crafting process. I'm going to be making mistakes in these. I'm not going to be editing a whole bunch of step-by-step -step scenes or anything like that. I do have some help sometimes from my friend John, the leg in black on Instagram. He films the close-ups and all that stuff. But uh, he's not always able to come up here where I live to help me film. So a lot of times I'm using a tripod and try to maneuver around it while crafting. So these videos aren't always gonna look very professional, but I hope you enjoy them anyway. And if you do enjoy them, make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're on YouTube, follow if you're on Instagram or TikTok, uh, like or follow on Facebook. And yeah, my link tree is in the bio in case you wanna check those out. And yeah, keep crafting.